practice and everything else y'all he wants y'all to do uh, in the game. Said, no, we're nowhere close. Is it really that bad right now? Uh, well, it's, it's quite a, it's quite a few things. It's, it's not that much, but it, it's a it's a decent amount, and they, it, they all take a, a required amount of focus, a required amount of mental attachment that, that he wants us to really hone. I feel like, and uh, we have we have a good understanding of it, and, and we're getting better. You know, as, as time continues, but he wants us to really, to really, really be able to grasp that concept and, and to for it to be like second nature to us. So. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've always, you know, tried to best I can influence, you know, expanding my game. But you know, with him in the system, uh, it's actually being expanded. You can see it. Uh, he, he, he wants everybody, you know, doing everything they can to, you know, impact the game, you know, and, and he provides opportunities in the sets and the plays that allow everybody to do everything they can to impact the game, so, you know, the more I can do. What are the biggest differences between Coach Green and Coach Green's style, play, buzz phrases, or how he's... They're, they're, they're different and similar in a lot of ways, I would say. Um, in some ways, in a lot of ways, they have the same ideals. They have the same concepts, just different ways of going about them, I would say. And uh, it's interesting to see his way of going about it, as opposed to the way I'm previously known to. And it's a lot more rapid fire. You know, it's, it's straight shot, it's high energy, high intensity, high focus, especially. So adding those things with the concepts, those are good concepts that I've already, you know, been, been doing for three years with the previous coach, just makes it all the more better. Coach talked about spacing. You mm -hmm. need to understand spacing in his way. I mean, I thought spacing was spacing, but what, what makes his spacing so specific? Uh, what makes the spacing so so specific, I would say, is that you know, in the aspect of the floor that he's broken down, um, he understands that almost literally every inch of the floor can be valuable. You know, can be used in whether a scoring opportunity or defensive opportunity. So when he says spacing in his term, it may be one more step, but it's a valuable step, and it's a step that will probably definitely help us get to our goal or get to what we're trying to do in that moment. So his idea of spacing, though only slightly different, very impactful. Uh, execution, I should say. Uh, to, to, to execute everything we can the best. We, we've been doing it against our, ourselves for far too long in the previous practices for, for a few weeks now. And, and uh, you know, when, when situations like that, you know, players become accustomed to slightly cheating it. And you know, you already know it. You've done it so many times. It's like second nature. So to be able to run it against somebody else, see how effective it is, and, and, and to do it properly, you know, the best we can is, is, is an opportunity I'm looking forward to. I want to ask you about Amonzi real quick. Mm -hmm. You've got to take him under your wing just a little bit. I have. I have. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's extremely talented. And, and I, I've shown him everything the, the, the best I can that, uh, to help him get a, get a better and, and, and truly get a strong and, and tight concept of, of everything we're doing, uh, as well as the skill set that he's, he's bringing into the table, just the combination of those two things. Make him that much better as a player. Further along defensively or offensively, right? Both. Yeah. Yeah. yeah he, he's 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 gradually he's gradually coming come along come along in, in both in both aspects and he's improving day by day. What do you think the biggest challenges for the team to be as competitive as you want to be? What, what areas? Um. To to for, for us to be as competitive as we want to be, I, I would say it it, it boil down to a mental thing. You know, to 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 mentally, to mentally truly, truly trying to understand it, trying to get a good idea, um, is what it, is what it really come down to. We have the talent, the skill set, the size, uh, to be able to put it together. You know, is the is the part that that comes a lot harder. So, to to see, and we we've been doing, we've been trying, we've been trying to make it work. We've been we've been, we've been doing everything we can, and we're, we're making it work. But we want to get it to a certain level, and that's what we're going after right now. Well, we're, 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 we go into practice every day with, with the same with the same mindset and same focus is, is to go after it. So, uh, you know, everybody everybody does their necessary and proper jobs, and we make those things happen.